Ahoy, fellas. Ah, uh, it's night time. Bye, guys. Where am I going? Dude. Dude. Where are you going, champ? Where are you going, sport? What the heck? Dang. What is happening? Sheesh. On the last episode, May confided in B that she going through a lot. There's some stuff going on in her head. Oh boy. This doesn't look good. Are you actually a ghost? Or just some guy? Who knows? <laughs> Yeesh. Talk! Are we gonna fight or whatever? Holy! <laughs> he has a crossbow! Holy. Arg, you shot me! <laughs> we can all use both of our arms. I will personally disassemble you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they freaking shot him! Greg pulled up with the gat. Anyways. <laughs> I just... I had a dream. You were all dead out here in the woods, and it was because of me. Is that how we're making decisions now? She kind of has a point. Uh, jeez. Hey, kiddo, we're out here, outside your head. Whatever's going on in there, it ain't as... Well, anyways. Sheesh. Okay. Nice. Me too, obviously. Yes, we all would be. Hmm. <laughs> and you're... God. You're definitely not dying out here. None of us are dying out here. Nice! We're not gonna die out here. That's great. I was afraid we were gonna be freaking dying out here. Yeah, I guess we follow the guy. You all wait here. I'll go. And be like, no. Anyways, yeah, let's just completely ignore what you just said. Tie him up? Yes, tie up the wolfman. He made some awu noise. He's probably a wolfman. Anyways. Thanks, big guy. She called him big guy. Yo, big guy reference. Reference to big guy. Famous person. Big guy. Famously big fella. Angus. Anyways. Gate's open. Isn't it always? It's a mine. Is there like a gate into the mine or something? Why would, why would you block it shut? That's like... <laughs> I have to go down in there. You roll a stone over in front of it like it's the tomb of Jesus Christ. Yep. Just one guy. I don't know if it's just one guy. Didn't weren't there like twenty people <laughs> the last time we were here? Yeesh. Anyways, let's get walking. Well, this isn't dangerous or anything. Yeah, it's just an old abandoned mine. Just who? Seriously? Yeah, not too late to throw ourselves into traffic instead. What she said, honestly. I'm glad they were being sarcastic with you. You can't always tell over text. Yeah, that's fun. Anyways. On we go. Is this a fun lever? Am I going to need to use the lever for anything? I didn't even get to pull the lever. Pull the lever, crunk. Yeah, I guess he did take the elevator down. Oh well. <laughs> Sure, we want to do this? I don't. We have to at this point. We already came into the mine. Sheesh. I don't know what's gonna happen down there. 
to any of us. It'll, it'll just be like that. Yeah, Angus. Big guy decision maker. Well, evidently the, the fun Woodland murder cult has been using the mine for at least the past week. Maybe even the past month. So there's that. I mean, we have that we have that little, uh, this is in the brochure for the town. We have that reassurance that the, uh, the fun wooden lord murder cult. Anyways, Angus has asthma? I don't know if, I don't know if that's really what would, maybe, I guess, but anyways, technically you're not wrong. So like asthma, that's how asthma is. It's not asthma, big guy. Yeah, big guy! Yeah! Big guy Angus! Angus, big guy. Heck yeah. I have to make a, a big guy reference now. I'm going to make Angus big guy. It's just gonna happen. You should be quiet. You should be quiet. Shut up. Anyways. I'm gonna save up for the screaming later. Absolutely. Let's get walking, though. I do actually really like, I was about to say how the party system works in this game. Just the way we were walking right there, it seemed to, it seemed they, they like kind of spread out naturally, like someone, like a group of people walking in a single file line might actually do, you know, wasn't so rigid. Wow, it's pretty, door, yeah, door, amazing. It's pretty loud down here for it being like underground and stuff. The resonance of the earth itself and wind blowing through the tunnel. I guess it's better than there not being any air in the tunnel. That would suck a lot. Yeesh! Inverted pentagram. That's always a great sign. Hmm? Yeah, a church of something, maybe. <laughs> Yeesh. What? What is it, May? It's here? What's here? An inverted pentagram? Yeah, we noticed. It's through here. Well, yeah, let's get going, then. I love these shenanigans I drag my friends into. Well, I guess they drag themselves into it, but... It be like that on occasion. Good friends that I have. Hey... Luckily, we still have... Shout out to the fact that... Oh, there it goes. Okay. It's back. I'm glad that they gave B a cigarette just for this moment so that we know where we are with reference to B's cigarette butt. Anyways. Well, how about this? Take a couple more steps forward if you want to die. Oh, jeez. Yeah, asshole, we're like five times scarier than you. Oh? Um... Yeah, that's kind of what I was saying. And I guess he was right. They're right there. I'm gonna kill them. What the heck? Hey, you'll do no such thing. It's out of your hands now. Sheesh. I'd say we're even. Little girl got shot at the other night. Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> It's a bad call, I'm sorry. <laughs> this, These are some fun... They're nice fun murder cult guys. Didn't actually hit. Oh, I hit. Bunch of old boys doing their dandest to perfect their own and their neighbors. Oh. What? Okay, now I'm kind of... What, was the guy at the start like a gang member or something? Anyways. All of you are part of this town. So, oh, are they like the defenders of contributors to society? To society? Hmm. He's not going to let you leave till he's had his say. Uh, sheesh. Kidnap that kid at harvest? It's been in my head somehow. I'm always tired. Constant headaches. It's been falling. Oh. 
No, I don't know what this is. What is this? What, you're telling me it's not a fun murder cult? I've seen this. Or I've felt it. It was Ed Scudder and it was... What is this? Is this the, 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 the hole to hell or something? Best Schmauzer. Schmoucher. Schmoucher? Shoemaker. Anyways. Shoemaker. Someone with that last name would probably just hate it if you called him Shoemaker. <laughs> but Shoemaker, whatever. It was out there when the company locked off the entrance. Carved his initials and date in the door, and then you got this mine, the old one. Not even a proper mine, big hole, copper. Abandoned, shoot, long before any of us were born. Too close to water. And that water was poison. Yeesh. That old spring used to be right above where we were standing. But that water dried up. And, uh, some fellas came back here, tried bootlegging. Practically built a new elevator, got the main tunnel cleared. Never found no coal, just dug deeper and deeper. Till Ed bursts through that wall and finds this place, and Jim walks right into that hole. Never hits the bottom. Yeesh. But someone else does. I know you heard that voice, girl. In dreams and in waking times. It's what brought you down here. So what does this have to do with you? anything. Yeesh. You got to understand, in those days, it was the end of the world. Jobs gone. Our kids were leaving. The government didn't care. Only wanted our votes. Those days? Interesting. Anyways. Spending our taxes on lazy people and immigrants while we worked ourselves to death. Yuck, here we go. Anyways, you finished? Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh boy. When Ed Scudder came down here and listened, he got answers back. Oh jeez, they're talking to Satan. I explained it to a few folks and they didn't believe it, but he was persuasive. He had the glimmer. It's just, uh, one, one, ones he takes you shining to. Yeah, jeez. You can do things. I said Ed could walk through walls. Oh boy. After that first time, after we picked one out, well, not only was the town holding stable, but it was almost like we were getting younger. And money came too. Still a few of us left from back then. What the heck? They throw a fella down this hole? First one was Tom Turner, who, believe you me, was a bastard. Just pure trash. And we got him down here and in the hole he went. Oh, jeez. He throw them in the hole? They throw people in the hole. Wow. And then the town is blessed with... Anyways. Every few months or so, he starts singing, and it's someone's turn to find someone. Is that what we were doing the other night? What happened the other night? Oh, one of our number broke the rules and had to pay up. That was a hard thing to do. Sheesh. Never pick no one who's gonna be missed. That's a solid rule. Drifters, drunks, and delinquents. Casey? Hardly kid. All he was gonna contribute to society Except a bunch of kids growing up with no dad. With a rap sheet a mile long. Oof. Yee. It's a real fun murder cult. Though I guess they just throw them down the hole. I still want to know what's down the hole taking up business with his cousin right you know what happened to his cousin burned alive when his little trailer lab exploded they had to wear hazmat suits when they cleaned him up 
That's where Casey was headed. Yeesh. And you want to act like you didn't... Oh, jeez. Well... His parents put up posters. Whew. Greg, I don't know if we really want to fight the Woodland Murder Cult right now. Alright, now. Throw it down right now or I will shoot. Oh, he's got an actual gun. I didn't I almost didn't see the silhouette of the like real gun at first. But no, he's straight up got like a He's got the freaking Joker he's got that Jack Nicholson Joker gun. He's got the he's got the freaking like foot long barrel revolver. <laughs> Holy <laughs> Bang. You brought guns down? It, yeah, it's a mine, honestly. Why would you do that? I guess, yeah, they never found coal, but it's still a mine. Yeesh. Greg, please put the crossbow down. I don't want them to cause a large dust explosion. <sighs> if only none of this were happening. We do it because we love our home. As long as we keep doing this... Possum Springs survives. Things can get better. Those mines are gonna be humming again someday. Old mills puffing smoke. You kids don't understand that. We lost what our world was built around. It used to be you provided for a family. You bought a house, and now you're stocked the shelves at the grocery store. Kids leaving more than they're staying. No opportunity here. Old people dying. Houses left empty. You ever seen that? Home become a tumbled in pile of wooden plaster. A job become a burned out brick box or a hole in the ground. We can change that. We can put this place back together. Or it won't be just shapes. Shapes. Am I joining the Woodland Murder Cult? I'm going to die down here. Dang, bro. Don't jump in the hole, May. You probably don't even have the strength to actually jump in the hole. Because we're getting old. Even with the fringe benefit of good health, we need new blood to carry this on when we're gone. They're like pitching. <laughs> They're pitching it to us. This is a pitch meeting. I finally get it. Nice. Were any of you even miners back in the day? <laughs> Is it just some big costume party murder club? <laughs> There's someone's shitty boss who's afraid of dying. That don't matter. I guess it kind of does matter, but, you know, I suppose they're not really miners, else they wouldn't be holding up firearms in a mine. Oh my gosh. I had, I had a substitute teacher in Spanish, and he was telling us about, um, God... He, he was telling us about how broken Spanish gets you friends in the Spanish-speaking world because they'll just laugh at you, right? And that's kind of how... That's how a lot of, like, Spanish-speaking culture is, is that they laugh at people, sort of. Um, God. <laughs> oh, man. But he was talking about a time that he was... He actually went with a couple of his friends down into a mine right and they were kind of messing with him because it was pitch black and they were messing with him like making him think they left him behind or whatever and he he called out to him and they didn't answer like that was the whole joke he said well screw you guys i'll just spark up a smoke and he he had his he had his camera up with the flash on and he he has he has a picture of these guys thinking they're about to be blown up to kingdom come because he put his camera flash on him and said that he was going to spark up a cigarette <laughs> in a freaking coal mine like Zoolander anyways <laughs> <sighs> we're all going to be dead soon anyways well, relatively speaking this town will be just fields and trees I know you've seen it I have seen it I've seen the origin of man. 
probably. I don't know. So we can leave? No one's going to stop you, but... Um, understand, you don't know who we are out there, but we know who you all are. Ain't fair they get to leave, and I probably got permanent damage. Well, jeez. We know who that guy is, sort of. Paid. Anyways. We don't know a thing about what he wants. What he is? Sheesh. Let's maybe get out of here. You leave that crossbow. Well, I could bish at you, but the truth is I just don't trust you. I can't move you guys. Yeah, we like the big guy. No idea what to think about any of this. It's just horror. Yeah, I guess. It's not a word you get to use too often. Well, anyways. Yeah, let's get the heck out of here. Anyways. Old stuff in here. Yep. Old tunnels full of old air and old men talking to old gods. Dark things. Anyways. What are you doing, Angus? Why do you have to put me down? Yeah, Casey. Oh well. And for what? I think I get it. Too tired to explain it right, but like, they lost what they thought was gonna happen. Which is what had happened like a long time ago. Or how they remember or like picture it. Things it gave them. So casing that kid at harvest and... Anyways. It's more sense than I can make of it. They're sad. It's all really sad. Oh, okay, he just got tired. That makes sense. Angus's arms got tired. He's a big guy, but he's not so amazingly big. Anyways. What the heck? Holy! Why you gotta do that? Ah! Oh, jeez. Okay, at least he's not... Oh no, it really is. I know what that silhouette looked like. That is not good. Oh jeez. Say something, man. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! May really just pulled it. Yeah! Sheesh. Holy. How are we gonna get out of here? It's a freaking cave in. We can't even. We don't even have, uh. We don't even have, uh. Bees. We don't have Bees' cigarette to light our way. Darn. I was a scout, Craig. Nice! Angus is so dependable and reliable. We love the big guy. We really love the big guy. Yep. Better now that I almost got murdered. Yep. Which is weird. If I had a nickel for every time I got murdered, I would have two nickels, which isn't much. But it's weird that it happened twice. Anyways. Alright. Well, let's take the arm with us, at least. It's all... It's boarded up a long time ago. Let's find out. Yeah, just break through. If, it, if these are old boards... Uh, yeah, help me out here, fellas. I'm the one that's, like, sick and stuff. Some fresh air, alright. And what? There's... It didn't dry up. Wow. Hopefully it's not a river. Well, yeah, cave rivers are terrible. Well. Hmm. I might have to leave it here for right now. I feel bad doing that, seeing as we're getting into, like, a real 
continuous part, but it's also been like a 30 minute episode, so I'm going to leave it there. Um, we found out the motive of the wooden murder cult. That's so fun. Anyways, that'll be all for right now, though. Till next time, like, comment, and subscribe, or I will rip your arm off. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.